hard for kids to focus in school, and no one knows that better than the people who are trying to teach them. And it's not just K-12, it can be college too, but Fayette County Public Schools have an initiative to help make learning fun for middle school aged children. Lake 18 Seven League joins us in studio this morning to tell us more, and this is a challenging age group. It certainly is, but this is a cool opportunity. I wish I would have had a program yeah. that I'm about to show you when I was yeah. a kid, yeah. but we say it a lot with work, right? Work doesn't feel like work when you're having fun right. with it. The same can kind of be said yeah. for kids in school as well. And as I found out at Lee's Town Middle School <laughs> yesterday, they are having fun learning without really realizing it. And our latest Positively LEX 18. I've seen at least, you know, eight to ten different ideas, you know, how to cover our, our forest. A rescue mission is underway at Leestown Middle School as kids in Mr. Sprinkle's class work to survey a hypothetical forest. We're learning how to code on certain apps by using the drone simulator. Mr. Sprinkle, our um, technology teacher, lays out tape and we measure them to find out our codes for the drones. Measuring, recording, programming, and taking flight with their drones. The drones have been fantastic. Fayette County is doing it you know, across the district in sixth grade. It's called a the Exploring Technology um, course. One of the big pushes was, was to use the drones to really get the kids excited about coding. Mission accomplished there. These kids are hustling back and forth from the forest to their computers to crack the code for their flyers to follow the right route. The takeoff blocks are to make the drone first fly up and start the code. So first, since it is on our code, it's flying out and turning so that we can get this part since the base isn't exactly on the edge. Pretty well said for a sixth grader, talking like engineers and pilots at just 11 years old. Are we repeating some of our, our maneuvers over and over again? Mr. Sprinkle has 23 years of teaching under his belt and is excited to see how excited his kids are, almost like learning in disguise. They're using math and they don't really realize they're using math or they're using science and they don't know they're using science. It's great to see kids um, highly engaged in something, they have an interest in it. You get to like do a ton of stuff with drones if, you have, if you're like new to drones and you yeah. haven't done anything before. It's really cool and like it introduces you to coding and everything. Students and teachers flying high as these drones open up a new world of learning. That is so cute and so appropriate how they're using this technology in schools. This, these drones are amazing. No, they really are just being able to use these and so many of the kids that I didn't even interview talk about how much they just love technology yeah. in general to have such the so much exposure to this. Mm -hmm. Again, if I was 11 years old, I would love to be playing around yeah, with that in, cl in class. That's I mean, the kids of today. Great though. way, great that's way right. to get them engaged yeah. for sure. Absolutely. All right, Evan, thanks so very much.